So I wanted to make a quick reference video on how to manually input a geo-referenced image such as one from Nearmap and overlay that um, in uh, AutoCAD 2007. Now I can't work out how to do this automatically like you can in the newer or later versions of uh, CAD so I've worked out how to do it um, manually using the J GW file that you can download with the imagery. So let's get started. First we want to go to the um, Victorian government website, spatial um, department, and first we want to search for VicMap property, which will give us the uh, property lines. So the one we want is VicMap pro property simplified one check the box and proceed to the order. Now we want to select the area. I'll go for the suburb of Newport. Uh, buffer minimum. Uh, we want the DWG file. Now we want the MGA 94 zone 55 because that's where we are. Apply it to the VicMap property uh, polygon thingo that you get and then submit that and you'll get an email. Now I've done this in advance because I'm prepared. So here's my link. Download the link. Wait a bit. Thank you very much. While that's downloading, let's go to near map and select an area or image within Newport to overlay onto our map. Uh, somewhere about there. Let's make it a bit bigger. Cover a few streets. Now, this is defined area, not the current selection. You can choose what you want. Oh, our download's finished. Extract it. Open it. And this will give you the uh, suburb of Newport. So we'll leave that aside for a second after we zoom in and have a look at what we got. Yep, all good. Now we'll go back to near map. Now we need the same area, MGA 94 zone 55, sorry, GDA 94, MGA zone 55. Now we want highest res, include the geo file, that's important. And take note of those pixels, we will use those later for setting the scale, but we'll look that back up. Close that. All right, we have downloaded Extract. Let's make this a bit bigger. So here's our JGW file, let's have a look. So in it, we have the coordinates and some scale references. Let's split the screen so we can see both. Now you can do this two ways. We can place a random object at the uh, geo reference so we know where we're going, or we can set that in the uh, image insert area. But the thing is that uh, we want to place the image with a base point of the top left. But if you enter this uh, geo referenced coordinate into the placement, uh, of the image, it'll place it as if it was with the, with the base point as the bottom left. So it can always be moved, which is probably an easy way of doing it actually. So, but I'll continue with this. So we've got our geo referenced area. Let's just put a line so we can see the center point. Insert. Actually, let's just check those pixels first. So there's our image. So the dimension twenty two eighty eight. This is to work out our scale. So in this JGW file, this number here represents the um, pixels per meter. So if we times the pixel width of the image by this number, that will give us the scale or the, the actual width in meters of the area covered. So let's get the calculator out. 2288 times 
Zero point zero. Yeah, just copy it to you. <laughs> Faced equals 170 meters. Point seven nine. Let's dump that there. And that's the area where we could specify it, but we've already put our reference. So let's just specify it on screen. Dump it down. Oh, I've covered our little line. Let's just move that out of the way so we can see it. Now let's select the top left corner, not the bottom. And we are aligned and scaled. So that should be pretty much right. Let's bring those lines to the front. Select all, shift to deselect the image and bring to the front. Let's just change the fading of that a little so those lines pop out more. Oh, we've lost our lines. Let's do it again. Shift, deselect, bring to the front. Let's just check some boundary lines. So these property lines line up very well with the edge of the footpath. Let's get rid of some of this junk. Deselect, 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 deselect. Oh, not that one. Yep. Very, very tight. Looks good. So that's how to manually enter a geo-referenced image.